Hello and welcome to Someka Retail KPI Dashboard for Google Sheets. To use the template, make sure you are online and sign in with your Google account. Then you have to make a copy of this file. Just go to File, then click on Make a Copy. Key performance indicators are crucial for any company and this tool lets you track these figures. This tool has two main sections. The first section is where you can input your values like KPI metrics, current year actuals, current year targets and previous year actuals. And the second section is where you can analyze your results like the monthly dashboard and trends and charts. Let's start with KPI metrics first. This is where you can add your KPI metrics. First, set your starting year from the starting day settings. Then input all your KPIs. This tool comes with the dummy data, but of course you will enter your own data. So let's add a new KPI for demonstration purposes. I'm going to add new KPI under general management here. Write down the unit type. If a KPI value indicates a better performance when it's actually lower, select yes. Well, in this case, I'm going to choose no. Then choose the cumulative calculation method. And you can write down descriptions for each KPI. Now I'm going to add the new KPI value to all tables, starting with current year actuals. I'm going to write the values manually, but of course you can easily copy and paste your data from an external source. Now I'm going to add the target values for the current year and the actual values for the previous year. Now that we input all our data, we can check the current year actual cumulative table. So this section shows you the cumulative data for the current year and is calculated automatically once you enter all your data. You can also check the cumulative data for the current year target and for the previous year actual. So let's check the dashboard section. This is where you can track monthly and cumulative performance for each KPI. And once you input all your data, the dashboard section will update itself accordingly. As you see, we can see the new KPI here and we can choose the month from the upper left section here. And lastly, let's check the trends and charts. You can also track your monthly and cumulative performance with charts and graphics for each KPI. And you can choose the KPI from the drop-down list above. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to check our other templates at someka.net.